Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're here for the first time, my name is Anne and in today's video I have a very short and quick video. But in today's video I'm going to show you a brow routine using only affordable products. I have done plenty of brow tutorials but never with affordable products so I feel like that's like why have I never done that? So it was about time. I'm using this NYX Cosmetics pencil and I will put all the exact details on all the products I used in the description bar. But this is a pencil from NYX Cosmetics. It looks very similar to the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz. Uh, I feel like quality wise it's almost the same. Um, it also has like a very precise point which you can use to create a very thin line. So the first thing I'm doing is creating a line all the way underneath my eyebrow. I'm doing this to create the shape of my eyebrow. Um, this way it's very easy. Like if you first draw on the shape and then later on you fill it in with the products. It's just like a really easy guideline. The same when you go in with lipstick. You first want to go in with a lip liner to create the shape of your lip. And then you're going to fill it in with products. That's basically the same. So I'm going to softly um, apply a little bit of product at the middle part of my brow. And press a little bit harder at the tail. I always like to keep my inner part or my beginning part of my eyebrow a little bit more soft. And the outer end I'm not really very careful with my pencil but at the beginning part I am um, I have a video where I kind of explain uh, brows do's and don'ts um, I will put it down in the description bar just so you know um, what I do and for what reason so right now I'm using the L'Oreal Puri Paradise pomade and I'm using it in the shade 103 and then after like filling in my eyebrows I'm taking the NYX Cosmetics HD concealer in the shade what is this shade let me check it's the shade 02 it's a very light color when I'm going to like um, carve out below my brows I like to go in with a shade as light as possible so it's not only to like make my brow look more neat but also to kind of highlight at the same time so I'm using my MAC 242 brush and I'm just going to create a sharp line right underneath the brow. This will kind of hide all the mistakes I made. It will make it look really sharp. I always feel like this makes my brows look like I just got them waxed. It just makes them look really flaky. So I'm doing this all the way underneath the eyebrow and I'm also going to do this at the upper part as well of course. Um, because at the outer end area. And then at the upper part, it looks really messy. So if you're doing your brows and you feel like hmm, it's not really looking great, you can always go in with concealer at the end and fix any problems, mistakes you have made. So don't worry, concealer is your best friend when it comes to brows. So now when I'm done with applying the concealer, I'm going to quickly brush to my eyebrows just to make sure that everything is blended into my skin and my hairs. Um, I want all the products I've used to blend into each other. Now I'm taking this Rimmel London Eyebrow Gel, which is the Brow This Way in the shade 003, which is called Dark Brown. And I'm applying it all the way over my brow hairs. Um, this will make them slightly darker and also um, make them stay in place all day. So then here you have the end result. I know this video is really short, but I just wanted to show you that you don't necessarily like need the most expensive brands to create a nice brow. So I hope this all gave you some inspiration. I will put all the products I've used for this look in the description bar below. And for this upcoming Sunday, I have a very exciting video, which I can't wait to show you guys. So hopefully I will see you in that video. And yeah, thanks for watching. Bye guys.